Assalamu alaikum learners. I know I have sent you the video on how to make a fraction wall, but I wanted to just show you how I do it as well. So how I use um, paper at home that's lying around or that's been semi-used, okay, to make the fraction wall. Um, so first I use my ruler to make my sizes equal. That way I don't get different measurements. So what I did is I took the ruler as you saw. I go to the edge of the paper and that will be my straight line. And then I just draw a line underneath to get my strip of paper. Okay. Then then I take my first strip of paper and I know that's my hole, right? And I write it down there. I take my next strip of paper, I fold it in half, I make a line, and I cut on that line. Okay, now I'm going a bit crooked. Okay. And like you see that my two halves will make a hole. I put it down there. Okay. I take my next strip of paper. I make it into half. And I make it into half again. That will give me quarters. Okay. And then I cut it up. If you didn't cut it up as well, if you left it just like this here and you wrote quarters also fine. The whole idea is for you to be able to see that you know what? Two quarters make a half, two halves make a whole. Okay? So that will give me quarters. Right? And obviously, to make thirds, I take the paper, I take the single paper and I try to divide it equally into three parts. So, If you look here at the bottom, I'm trying to make it um, into equal lines. Fold it into three equal parts. If you had a bit of a problem with this and it didn't come out exactly, don't stress because it's still going to show you your three parts. It's still going to show you that, you know what, the paper, one whole okay, is made up of um, one third, one third, and another one third okay then your quarters and then well i'm short of one more so i'm going to take my strip of paper draw my line cut I forgot to write my thirds here. And of course, you're going to stick this into your book, right? My strip of paper, I fold in half, get two halves, fold in half again, I get quarters, fold in half again. And what do I get? And I just press it down so that you know what, it's easy to cut or even if I open it and I don't cut, the lines are easy to see. And when I open it, as you can see, one, oh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Each part is a eight. Right. I hope that helps. I'm, I know I did send a video, but for those who are still struggling, I thought I'd just show you how I do it, did it at home. Jazakallah.